Hi guys, welcome back to episode two of the Book the US series with Booking.com and myself. Today we are exploring Georgia. My name is Cameron Phillips and this summer Booking.com sent me on a quest to find the most unique properties around the United States. This is the adventure of a lifetime with properties so amazing that you'll never want to stay in a regular hotel again. With this series, I'm offering everyone $30 of free travel credit on Booking.com to jumpstart your adventure. Make sure to use the link in my bio to get your free $30. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss an episode and follow me on Instagram to see more of these iconic properties. So here we are at the Chateau Elon in the middle of nowhere in Georgia. Guys, this place is a trip. We're driving down, imagine this, we're driving down the highway in Georgia surrounded by nothing but trees, forests, about an hour and a half from Atlanta. And then all of a sudden we come over this hill and there is this French country mansion sitting amongst vineyards, literally in the middle of nowhere. I was not expecting this place to be so big. It is literally a massive resort that you can tell a lot of people come up for the weekend or for different corporate events. And it's honestly pretty cool. Today's a pretty exciting day because it's our one full day here. We're off to explore. We're about to head to a free wine tour to check out the history of the place, taste their wine, see what's going on here. You guys know I love wine. I've done a lot of wine events, so I'm super excited to see how I don't think I've ever had wine from Georgia, honestly, so I'm excited to see how it compares, um, see what's going on here at the Chateau Elan. Look from our room, we have a view of the pool. We will definitely be in there later on. It is super hot outside, that southern humid heat. But anyways, with all that, we're gonna head off to the winery house, which is up the hill, check in for our tour, see what's going on here at the Chateau Elan. We're on the balcony here at the winery of the Chateau Elan, looking out over the vineyards over here. We have the garden, the statue, it's super beautiful. We're about to start our wine tour, which I'm super excited for. The whole premise of this place is wine and luxury and vacation, and I'm excited to see what their wine is all about and what the history of this place is. I've been meaning to look it up, haven't gotten the chance to it yet, but I know they'll talk about it on the tour. So, without further ado, to the tour. I didn't even know there were any wineries in Georgia, let alone this giant resort complex mecca center. I was definitely surprised. So staying in this place is actually super fascinating because I've been to several other wineries in California and in Italy and in Oregon and some other states. It was amazing hearing about their process because like every winery is different. They all kind of go about the same way making wine, right? This place was actually a little bit different because they use muscadine grapes, which is a different grape variety that is not used in traditional like wine making in the sense that we know wine, you know, like Chardonnay, Pinot Noir, Sauvignon Blanc. That's the different grape variety. Muscadine is a totally separate thing. So it was interesting hearing the history of muscadine. Thank you. Thank you. The tasting room was gorgeous. They had several different bars. It seemed like a great place to have like, like big parties, birthday parties, like gatherings. We did two tasting flights, like one each. We did an old world red and a red tasting. So each of these tastings were eight wines, which is a lot for a tasting, and they were all really big pours too. Experiencing Georgia wine, it actually is not Georgia wine. Here's the thing, they import the grapes from California, they drive them across the country and produce them at their facility in Georgia. The actual grapes they grow there are the muscadine grapes. So everything that we tasted though was the California grapes that they bring in from California, right? So our time at the Chateau Elan has come to an end. It was such a quick two days, it felt even quicker than Miami because yesterday it rained in the evening. This place was amazing, the wine was pretty good, and it was amazing experiencing the Georgia tradition of wine, the muscadine grape. With that though, we're heading back closer to Atlanta to go to a bar that serves up fresh Georgia craft beer. I'm super excited, apparently the owner is gonna show us in the kitchen, and let's see what happens from here. Then this afternoon we're off to Chicago for destination number two, but that is another video. Destination number three, number three. Oh my God, this is literally week one, destination three. Craziness, anyways, it's hot, we gotta call it Uber, gotta go guys. We're here from the Earth Brewery in Roswell, Georgia, which is North Atlanta. This place is iconic. They've taken this amazing synthesis of design. We have modern, we have elegant, we also have like, accessibility, and you feel like you can just fit right in here. It's comfortable, it's casual, but it's beautiful. They are a craft brewery, and as you can see right behind me, they make all the production in-house. It's not super big, but we're here with the owner, Tim. He's gonna take us through some of their favorite beers, and I'm super excited to be here. This place is really cool.
So we're in the Uber on the way to the airport and that's gonna end the Atlanta portion slash the Georgia portion of this Booking.com adventure. We just had an amazing time at From the Earth Brewery. They offered an incredible array. The owner, Tim, was so nice to us. He showed us a wide variety of all of his beers and how they do their whole process. Make sure to check out PhenomenalTraveler.com for the full story on From the Earth Brewery. With that being said, we're off to the airport. We're going to Chicago today to go to stay at an iconic historical house and then start a little mini road trip across, uh, what is that, the Midwest area of the US? Super, super excited. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to find the links down below and we'll see you guys in the next episode of the Booking.com adventure. Bye. We are in Chicago, Illinois, my first time ever in the city.